we realize that under the current circumstances, one of the limiting things in this epidemic is the ability to test for who has the infection. This is critical because if we're going to be able to separate those with the infection from those that don't have the infection, we need to know who's infected. Right now, the testing capabilities of the state of Arizona are relatively limited, and so it turns out that Arizona State University has for a long time had a big interest in diagnostics, and we have a number of capabilities that allow us to test many, many samples all at the same time. These capabilities include robotics that help us with the automation of sample handling and devices that can read many samples simultaneously. In the current setting, we're hoping to start with 400 samples a day, but we'd like to build that up to over a thousand samples a day. I think the overall time to run all those samples will be several hours. A lot of the testing that's currently available uh, is handled one sample at a time. It involves individuals who are transferring liquid from one tube to another tube and then running an assay. Um, at that pace, typically a facility might be able to handle 100 samples a day. What we have are robots that do all of this for us. Because, you know, I don't think given the burden that's coming, one, samples one at a time is going to get us there. Uh, we need to be thinking big and we need to be thinking bold. We want to build on, the, on what's been learned in other places. And what's been learned internationally is that one of the best ways to collect samples from people is using a drive-through approach. Lots of reasons for that. One is speed. You can, uh, a lot of drive-through places can get people in and out in under 10 minutes. The other advantage is that uh, people who may be infectious won't be walking and sitting in clinics where they might be uh, potentially infecting other patients. So we'd like to get those kinds of drive-through facilities going here in the state of Arizona. I'd like to go live Monday. That's my goal.